As a classical musician, I've played a lot of weddings for money, and that's been nice. I used to have a very positive approach to it, you know? It's like, I'll get to go to so many weddings, so I'll get to see what I want for my wedding and, like, what I don't want. And then I realized what I don't want is a wedding. <laughs> I, I thought about it. I want to be married one day. I just don't want to get married, right? I don't want a wedding. It's too much pressure on one day. Too many things could go wrong. I played a wedding once where the officiant just didn't show up. The couple just married themselves. It's very sad. They were like, do you? Yeah. Do you? Yeah. All right, let's eat. I was like, I think you're still single. I don't think that worked. I might want to check on that. But, but. Relationships can be, can be tough, their work. I was seeing a guy for a while and he wanted to settle down and I was like, look, I got a lot of things I want to do before I settle down. Like, find the right person. That's a big one. A lot of things, so. We have a lot of things we want to do in life, right? My friend, she just quit her high paying day job to follow her dreams. Uh, she says she doesn't want to have regrets on her deathbed. That's what she says. I was thinking about it though, the deathbed, that's the best time to have the regrets. You don't have to live with them for very long. <laughs> Who cares if in your dying breath you're like, I should've opened a bakery, ah. Oh. <laughs> no time to cry about it. <laughs> I cry a lot, I do, uh, I cry a lot. I look really good when I cry, so it's bittersweet. <laughs> I catch myself in the mirror, I'm like, <laughs> oh. <laughs> I had no idea. <laughs> Seriously, I got my heart broken, best I ever looked. <laughs> I have had my heart broken and taught me a lot about love. Here's what I learned about love, all right? Love is the only thing that when you lose it, you doubt it ever existed in the first place. No one ever loses their keys and they're like, maybe there never were any keys, I don't even know. Maybe I've just been letting myself in with lies. <laughs> I'm in a relationship now, it's going very well. I love him very much. Uh, he took me camping recently though, and uh, camping is stupid. <laughs> you go outside, and then you do all this work to make it feel like you're still inside. <laughs> We brought a stove to the woods, and we have a better one at home. We're just trading in all our stuff for worse versions of it. Why? It's like we're just doing some cheap demonstration for nature on how we live. The tent, we're like, all right, well, normally this is a door. Today it's a flap. Use your imagination. <laughs> Thanks for watching. Be sure to download the Drybar app, and when you do, use promo code Isabel Hagen.